when you're using the air roller, it's best that you do it standing up like this instead of on your knees. But before you try it standing up like this, you have to find the right spot for you. So first, what you're going to do is, you're going to stand close to the wall and do it. And if you don't feel it in your abs, or if it's too easy for you, you're going to keep backing up until you find that perfect spot where doing 8 to 20 reps is going to put your abs on fire. So basically, if this exercise is too hard, you're going to stand closer to the wall. And if it's too easy, you'll stand farther away from the wall. Once you found your spot, it's a good idea to measure how far away you are from the wall so you can continually get a better air workout and a more defined six pack by moving back a little bit farther each time you do this. So after each workout, write down where you were and at least do the same thing the next workout or try to move back an inch or move back a little bit more each workout. Now when you're doing this exercise, you're basically falling over forward into the wall. So notice how my heels come up off the floor and also see how my head stays almost directly over the air wheel until the very end of the movement. Now another reason why you may not feel this in your abs is because you may be reaching out more with your arms instead of just falling over and squeezing your abs to prevent you from crashing too hard into the wall. Another thing you can do, which you don't have to, for a better ab workout is that you want to roll out slowly and touch the wall with the air wheel without making any noise at all. If you don't have an ab wheel, you can do this exercise using an office chair. You can do it at your gym using a bar loaded with circular plates. You can do it at home on a slick floor using rags or old clothes. Basically, anything with wheels on it or that allows you to slide across the floor can be used as an ab wheel. Let me give you some safety tips to prevent you from getting hurt while using an ab roller. Be conscious the whole time of where your body is and be ready to act just in case you might fall. Make sure that your head is directly over the air wheel almost the entire time all the way up to the very end to prevent you from tripping up. If possible, make sure you have someone spot you who can catch you if you're not comfortable doing this exercise alone. When you're using the air roller, it's best that you do it standing up like this instead of on your knees. But before you try it standing up like this, you have to find the right spot for you. So first, what you're going to do is, you're going to stand close to the wall and do it. And if you don't